On your marks, get set, go. College of the Canyons was the host site for the Western State Conference prelims last week. And one of COC's very own is ready to go the distance. Honestly, just everybody that has like all the positive energy towards me and how, how much they believe in me. So I think it's just all the positive energy that I get from everybody. And that's really what helps me, you know, do the best I can do. Matthew Ballantyne isn't just on pace with his peers. He's the only decathlete representing College of the Canyons. Honestly, I didn't know what a decathlete was. So I basically just like, I mean, if I have, you know, if they see it in me, then I might as well just do it. I don't want to like, you know, have any regrets for me not to do it when I'm older. But so I was like, I'll just do it if they see the potential. Ballantyne might be best known for his contributions to the Cougars football team. Prior to this year, Ballantyne had never competed in any track and field in his life. That was until he was approached by track and field coach Lindy Kane. Season ended and I still kept working on football and I would just be on the field all the time. And she would always see me there, like working on myself, just doing whatever I normally do. And one time she came up to me and she said, why don't you do track? And I was like, um, you know, like, I'm just, I'm just, you know, it's really a football guy. And I started doing my individual events and they saw something in me. And they're like, let's just make you a decathlete. And I was like, all right, I mean, might as well. <laughs> He's brought um, his competitiveness um, and just uh, leads by example and just the willingness to try different events and be a team player. Now, Ballantyne is leading the pack, placing fifth in his most recent decathlon and securing a spot in the state championships. On this day, Ballantyne competed in the javelin throw and the 110 meter hurdles placing first and sixth respectively. A tune-up for the state championship, Ballantyne still views the day as an opportunity to challenge himself. Being a decathlete is pretty much just like an individual type sport. So the pressure that it comes with being a decathlete definitely helps with just, you know, just keeping that, you know, if it's going to get hard, you know, it's going to happen, adversity is going to happen. And I feel like it's really been helping me level out the adversity. With an eye toward his future, Ballantyne remains grounded as he dashes toward the finish line of what has been a remarkable rookie season. Reporting for Canyons News, I'm Matthew Frieda.